It may seem a little weird, but multiplying and dividing fractions is actually easier than adding or subtracting them. Just two easy steps and you're done. To multiply two fractions, multiply the numerators or the numbers on top to get the numerator of the answer. Then multiply the denominators or the numbers on the bottom to get the denominator of the answer. In this case, the answer is six over 35. Sometimes when you multiply or divide fractions, you may be able to reduce the answer to the lowest terms. As a rule, math people are crazy about reduced fractions and teachers sometimes take points off a right answer if you could have reduced it but didn't. When multiplying fractions, you can often make the job easier by canceling out equal factors in the numerator and denominator. That makes the numbers that you're multiplying smaller and easier to work with. And it also saves you the trouble of reducing at the end. Dividing fractions is just as easy. In fact, when you divide fractions, you really turn the problem into multiplication. Start by turning the second fraction, or the divisor, upside down, making it into a reciprocal fraction. For example, 4 fifths becomes 5 fourths. Then, change the division sign to a multiplication sign and multiply the fractions across. Here, we get 5 twelfths. And that's the basics of multiplying and dividing fractions.